I want you guys to start calling Marvin Vittori angry Marvin Vittori. I want that to be his new nickname. And we can make that stick. Look, one thing with nicknames, okay, your parents give you your name. Nicknames are supposed to be given by somebody else that isn't your parents. It could be a family member. It could be a brother or sister. It generally will come from classmates. But generally, you don't get a nickname. But if you get a nickname, it will come from classmates. Nicknames don't come from you. You don't go, hey, my name is Tony. Call me Hawk. Like, you don't do that. Somebody else has to do that. So I only bring that to you because in the world of fighting, people always want to give themselves nicknames, which is just weird. It's just a weird thing, and that isn't how nicknames work. And so when I bring to you Angry Marvin, we need to name Marvin Angry Marvin because that's what we want. Angry Marvin Vittori is one of the more interesting characters in all of MMA. Marvin Vittori, you know, take it or leave. Angry Marvin, oh, must see. This guy's must see TV. We got to name him that. And I, I'm responsible for one nickname, Short Fuse Ed Herman. I'm responsible. Chris Levin got the credit. Here's what happened. We're all training together. And Ed Herman and Chris Levin, they were young guys at the time, 21, 22 years old. So they were into the, the night scene. They were going out to the clubs together and stumbling home at 2.30 in the morning. And Levin was telling me a story of how angry Ed can get. He goes, hey, he can get pissed off, you know, particularly when he's drinking. He's got a short fuse. You got to be careful what you say to him. So I was promoting a small local show, and I was also in charge of the programs. So when I made the programs before I sent it all to the print shop and had them made and picked them up, I put Ed Short Fuse Hermit. I named him Short Fuse. I put it right in the program, put it out, distributed to all the people. So when Ed gets it, now he sees what his nickname is. He's Short Fuse. But that's how you get a real nickname. That's a great nickname for Ed. But that's how you get an appropriate nickname if somebody else gives it to you. Now, I don't get I don't get credited for that because I admitted where I took it. I took this from a comment that Chris Lieben made. But Chris Lieben was saying he has a short fuse, not he is a short fuse. I should have got the credit, but I didn't get the credit. Ed Herman tells people that Chris Lieben named him that. A little bit of a play on words. I do want Angry Marvin. I want Angry Marvin. And I think right now he's the Italian stallion or he's the Italian dream or he's the Italian bully. He's something to do with that. I don't want that. I want you guys to agree. And I agree, the Italian bully or the account, whatever he is, I agree where it sounds a little bit cooler. But play with me for a minute here. Angry Marvin rolls right off the tongue. I mean, I even consider pissed off Marvin. But you have to understand that Bruce Buffer is going to read that name to the world on ESPN. So you got to you got to operate a little bit more. And pissed off Marvin doesn't roll off the tongue like angry Marvin. Angry Marvin is what we want. Angry Marvin is who he is. Start calling him that.